Okay, this is like my third take trying to do this, just because I'm trying to get it as quickly and smoothly as I can, while still being understandable. So I'm going to show you how I personally make, you know, and this is how a lot of people, other people do it too, how I make, uh, you know, looping news 3 audio files for Smash Ultimate. So we're going to use this as a test. This is what I'm going to loop. As you can hear, unfortunately, you can hear, this is already set up where, like, you know, start to finish, it's a, it's a .wav file. This is the .wav file I just tested out. So, there's no loop points or anything you need to mess with. I'm not going to go into that. You should, uh, yeah. That's, that's a completely separate thing. But that's, yeah, that's, that's the audio we're going to loop. It's a, it's a .wav file. It's not already set up to loop. You could also use .mp3s or, you know, any, I, anything else that's supported. So, you should have Smash Ultimate tools installed already and set up. This is, I use, this is where I keep all my shit. So, mod making tools, Smash Ultimate tools, you should have it all set up already. You should have seen the tutorial to do that. So, we launch it. Okay. Audio. I should like to put in a little window like that. And okay, so I just put it in here. Now you you're wanting it to loop, so you know click enable looping. And don't mess with this, and don't mess with these two boxes either. Leave these blank because you know it says leave the fields empty to loop the full song. We're going to be looping the full song from start to finish. If you didn't want to do that, you could you know open the file in Audacity. I'll just show you just as a quick example too, just as a little bonus how I do that. So let's say I wanted it to loop from like the halfway point for some reason. So you know, you click this, you grab samples, like this little window, oh, samples. That's the best one. And then you just type whatever numbers are like, let's see, yeah, start and end of selection. So I selected it from here to here. It's a terrible loop, but this is a quick example. So, yeah, if I wanted to, to loop exactly like that, you know, grab that, copy the sample, the first loop sample. The start of the, you know, it's because it's the selection. You need to click that too, start and end of selection. So the first part I selected is at sample zero, and then the second part I selected is at 114,782. So it'll loop from that point that I set earlier. Of course, this is, uh... Since this is just a full song loop, you leave those blank. Now, I don't know what you're trying to replace, but if it's a victory theme, if for some godforsaken reason you want to replace Marth's victory theme with Hong Kong 97, for example, or I guess, guess it doesn't really matter who, I guess it's Charizard. Fucking, yeah, yeah, Wario. Wario with the Hong Kong 97 theme. It'll automatically name it properly like that. So then you just click convert. And it's complete. So if it boop. Alright. I'm just gonna save that on the desktop. Just for ease. And that file should have appeared here. Yeah. So this is the Hong Kong 97 theme. If you're not sure that that actually got it to work. If you have News 3 Audio Editor installed, I'll show you that really quick. You know, if you have that installed, this is just a useful program if you plan on doing more uh, News 3 Audio stuff. So, click that, open, and you could test whether or not it loops by just pressing preview. Oh, sorry. Clicking that, then pressing preview. <laughs> Yeah, see, it loops properly. So now when you drag this into your game, you know, in the proper place, which I'll also show you that, just as, you know, again, as a little bonus, just a little treat. Let me see. Downloads. Uh, 
I already have Midbus set up here, and I'm too lazy to plug in my Switch. But yeah, if you had a mod, if you wanted to make the mod, it'd be something like this. So like, Wario Hong Kong. And in the file path that that would take in the Smash Ultimate folder, it, you'd first click, you know, stream with the little, you know, semicolon. Folder named sound inside of that. Oh. And a folder named BGM, if I remember this correctly. Yeah, and then you put that in here, and this will replace Wario's uh, <laughs> victory theme with the Hong Kong '97 theme. If you drag this whole, if you drag this folder into your, you know, your ultimate slash mods folder, and then you put this in the mods folder, that's how that's how you'll hear that loop. So, so you know, that's it. 